हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू इंजीनियर्स अकेडमी डू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल इफ़ यू हैवन डन इट इट नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम विच सीज दैट अ टबो गन हैविंग अ मास ऑफ टेन के जी स्टार्स फ्राम रेस्ट एट ए एंड केर इज अ गर्ल एंड बॉय हैविंग अ मास ऑफ फोर्टी के जी एंड फोर्टी फाइव के जी रिस्पेक्टिवली वेन द टबो गन रीच इज द बॉटम ऑफ द स्लोप एट बी द बॉय इज पुस्ट ऑफ फ्राम द बेक विद हॉरिजेंटल विलासटी ऑफ वी बी ऑफ टी टू मीटर पर सेकेंड Measured relative to the tabogun, determine the velocity of the tabogun. Afterwards, neglect fraction in the calculation. So we have to find the velocity of the tabogun when the boy is pushed off with a relative velocity of two meter per second towards the right. So for that, first of all, we have to find the velocity of the tabogun at point B. So when before the boy is pushed off, we have to find that velocity. So to find that velocity, we have to apply. the law of conservation of energy so the law of conservation of energy says that we have to apply the law of conservation of energy between point a and b so the law of conservation of energy says that the kinetic energy at a plus the potential energy at a this will be equal to the kinetic energy at b plus the potential energy at b so for potential energy we need to define our datum line so at the bottom surface this is my datum line and at a the turbo gun along with the boy and girl it is at rest so at a at point a the turbo gun is at rest so the velocity is zero so the kinetic energy at a is equal to zero and the potential energy at a will be equal to the weight times h from the datum line the distance from the datum line so the distance from the datum line is this h so we will write that this is mass the total mass times g times h this will be equal to the kinetic energy at point b so that will be 1 divided by 2 the total mass and into v b so let's say that the velocity of the turbo gun at the bottom of this hill is v b so this is v b square and this v b is the velocity of the turbo gun uh when the boy and the girl are sitting on the turbo gun right when the boy is uh is there right so when he is not pushed off so this is v b square and and at point b the turbo gun is on the datum line so the potential energy at point b will become zero and the total mass is we can write that the total mass is equal to the mass of the boy plus the mass of the girl plus the mass of the turbo gun so the mass of the boy is 45 the mass of the girl is 40 and the mass of the turbo gun is 10 so this gives us 95 kg So now, if we look into this equation, we are left with this, and if we divide both sides of the equation by the total mass, so this will cancel out, and from this we can write that v b square is equal to two g into h, and if you want to find that velocity, so we have to take the square root on both sides. So this v b is equal to two into nine point eight one, and h is equal to three meters. So we will multiply this with three. So this gives us. Square root two multiply by nine point eight one multiply by three. So this gives me the velocity of the of the turbo gun when the boy is sitting there, right? So that is V B is seven point six seven two meter per second. So this is the velocity of the turbo gun just before the boy is pushed off, right? So now, after that, we have to find the velocity of the turbo gun when the boy is pushed off with the relative velocity of two meter per second. So in order to find that velocity, we have to apply the law of conservation of momentum. So we have to apply the law of conservation of momentum uh, before and after the boy is pushed off, right? So this is the m, um, the momentum before the boy is pushed off, and this is the summation of the momentum after the boy is pushed off. so when before the momentum before the boy is pushed off is the total momentum we have to write that the total mass times vb when the boy is uh, before the boy is pushed off the velocity is vb the we have just determined that velocity this will be equal to when the boy is pushed off so then the momentum is split into two momentums so one is the momentum of the boy so the mass of the boy is m small b times vb v small b is the velocity of the boy and then we have to write plus the 
momentum of the toboggan of the remaining mass so the remaining mass is the mass of the girl plus the mass of the toboggan times the velocity of the toboggan so when the when the boy is pushed up the velocity of the toboggan is v small t now we are applying this law of conservation of momentum in this direction this is our positive direction so this is my positive direction so if this is my positive direction so the velocity of the toboggan this vb this v capital b is in this direction that is towards the left so this is positive and then when the boy is pushed off this vb is towards the right so this is negative so let me represent that v small b this is v small b and this is in the negative direction so our positive direction is towards the left so v b is towards the negative so we have to write minus sign here and then when the boy is pushed off so the toboggan continues in this direction that is vt so this vt this is positive so we have to consider this as this v small v is negative now the total mass is 95 this is 95 times vb and vb is 7.672 minus the mass of the boy is 45 times vb plus the mass of the girl is 40 plus the mass of the toboggan is 10 into the velocity of the toboggan this is 95 into into 7.672 this gives us 728.84 minus 45 vb plus 50 vt now we are given the relative velocity so let me write the relative velocity equation so this is vb of t this is equal to vb minus v of t and for applying this equation we need to consider that same positive convention so this is our positive direction we are going to consider this as our positive direction since we have considered the same positive direction for applying this equation so we have to keep the assume positive direction is same for applying both the equations v b is acting in the negative direction so we have to write minus this is minus v b and v t is acting in the positive direction so we have to write that this is minus v t this is v b of t and now if i put those values v b of t is 2 meter per second so v b of t is acting in this direction and this is our positive direction so we have to consider this as negative this is minus 2 so i have to write that this is minus 2 this is minus v b minus v t so from this equation we can write that if i bring this v b to the other side of the equation so this will become v b minus 2 equals to minus v t or we can write that v t is equal to 2 minus v b so now we have this equation of v t in terms of v b so now if i substitute this equation in this so we will be able to find the velocity of the toboggan when the boy is pushed off so this is 728.84 this is equal to minus 45 now vb is 2 now we we have to write this vb in terms of et uh, sorry this is we have to replace this this from this we can write that vb is equal to 2 minus vt if i bring this minus 2 to the other side so it will become positive so now we have to write that this is we have to substitute vb we have to substitute this vb so vb is equal to 2 minus vt so this is 2 minus vt and this is equal to plus 50 vt so this is 728.84 and minus 45 into 2 is minus 90 and minus into minus plus 45 vt this is this is 45 vt plus 50 vt and if i bring that 90 to the other side of equation so this will be 728.84 plus 90 and this is 95 vt and now vt is equal to 728.84 plus 90 divided by 95 so this will be the velocity of the toboggan 
when the buoy is pushed off. So this is 728.84 plus 90 divided by 95. So this gives us 8.619. 8.619 meter per second this is the velocity of the treble gun when the buoy is pushed off when the uh, before the buoy is pushed off the velocity is 7.672 now when the buoy is pushed off the the velocity of the treble gun is increased that is 8.619 and it is since it is positive so it is in the it is towards the left in the in our positive direction that is our positive assumed direction so this vt is acting in this direction now to find vb we have to put that value in this equation this is vb and this is 2 minus 8.619 so this will give us 6.6619 uh, mm, and this will be minus this is in meter per second so the minus sign tells us that this VB is acting in the opposite direction of our positive assumed direction. So our positive assumed direction is towards the left. So VB has a magnitude of 6.619 meter per second and it is towards the right. So we were asked to find the velocity of the toboggan when after the buoy is pushed off. So this is that velocity that is 8.619 meter per second. So this is the solution of this particular problem. I hope this will help you in your learning. Do subscribe my channel for the solution of such more problems from Hibbler Dynamics.